Site for Business is a tool from Microsoft Office 365 Productivity Suite. It is widely used for unified communication within and outside the organization. Apart from scheduling meetings, supporting audio video calls and file sharing, Skype for Business allows you to record your online meetings that you can easily refer in future or share with your colleagues. For example, if any of your team member was absent from a meeting and you want to share the key points of the meeting with him or her, in such a scenario, you can simply share the recording with them instead of drafting an email to share the key points from the meeting. Further, you can use this feature if you plan to conduct a webinar. Let's say that you scheduled a 60 minutes webinar for few internal attendees and some external attendees. However, only few of them could turn up. Now, either you will have to schedule it again, which will consume your 60 to 90 minutes or more, or you can simply share the recording of the session with the attendees who would like to view the session again. Let me show you how a meeting can be recorded in Skype for Business. For that, you need to join the Skype for Business meeting with the meeting link that you have received on your mail. For example, I had scheduled a Skype meeting with Meghna and Anshita, so we can join the meeting with the link that we have got in the mail. I can now click on OK to join this meeting. Once, when the attendees will join the session, you can see the participant's name in the participant's pane. So here are the three participants. Now, to start the recording of the meeting, click on More Options button in the IM window and select the option as Start Recording from the list. A message will pop up stating that the recording has started. You can use the controls at the bottom of the meeting to pause, resume, or stop the recording. You can also see who else is recording the meeting by pointing at the red recording button. So here you can see that I am the one who is recording this meeting currently. Once the meeting will finish, you can stop the recording. A notification will pop up informing you about the status and location of your recording. You can check the status of your recording in the Skype for Business Record Manager. To open the Skype for Business Record Manager, go to the Skype for Business main window. This is the Skype for Business main window. Click on the drop down arrow next to options. Select the option as tools and further select the option as recording manager. The recording manager window for Skype for Business will open. Select the recording to highlight it and select the play option. The recording will get played on Windows Media Player by default. To share your recording with other users, click on browse to locate the recording on your local system. You can then copy the file to your OneDrive for Business and then share it with other users. This feature helps you to always have the content of your meetings which you can refer anytime, anywhere and can easily share it with other users. This is for now. To know more about amazing features of Skype for Business, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.